it's uh, Paul Hurst here from Paul on Twitter and from Paul's iPhone on YouTube with a uh, quick video review of the Oro Clip. Uh, this is the uh, three lens Oro Clip, all in one for the iPhone, uh, iPhone 5 in this case. Uh, and it's just so that you can see what kind of footage you get. Obviously, I'm just using a standard iPhone 5 at the moment, uh, and this is. Um, uh, I'm going to put this uh, attachment on here and show you the different lenses that you get. All comes in this uh, pouch and you get some lens caps as well for the Oro Clip. The Oro Clip itself is really simple to attach, just goes over the corner of the iPhone there as you can see and the lens then aligns itself um, with the lens that's built in to the camera, to the, uh, to the iPhone camera. So let's uh, let's get cracking then. So as you can see, this is the field of view that you get with the normal uh, phone. I'm probably going to have to stop talking because this guy who's walking up will think I've gone nuts. Um, but that's the standard field of view that you get. So let's put the OLED clip on. Okie dokie, so the Oro Clip now um, just popped over the camera there and as you can see it's a wider field of view that, uh, that I'm now getting with the camera. So just to compare, that's without and then that is with. And that's the first lens that you get there. Somebody just scaring the birds. Oh dear. Um, so that's the first lens that you get with the Oro Clip. Just got to come around here. And then next up you've got a fisheye attachment. So I'm just going to take it off and then put it back on. Uh, and this is actually an even wider set. So um, you can't really see at the moment but I'm not. There's a, a small child over there, so I don't want to film over there at all. Um, so if I come here, you can see when I move now that the, um, the the video footage is very wide indeed. So it gives this kind of quite a strange effect, really. It's quite nice. Now, when you take photographs with the Oro Clip, you do get a surround, a kind of circular surround, because this is effectively 170 degrees of vision that this is filming on now but as you can see it's super duper wide getting lots of uh, lots of the scene in there and as I say when you use this in photographic mode you do get a circular uh, surround because it effectively is fisheye so just to compare if I show you the normal field of view again, that's what you get normally off the iPhone 5. So this is the Oro Clip. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to unscrew this lens. Just pop it in my pocket for now. And now the, the third lens and final lens is actually a macro lens, which is why... Uh, why it's gone like that, you can't really see anything at all there. But if I just walk over to um, to a, a bush or something like that to get some detail, um, then as you can see, I'm not very good at using the lens. Very shallow depth of field. Probably not that usable in video mode, the macro lens. Because it is just too... Um, you have to get so close to the object. But what I'm going to do is I will include some um, I will include some stills so that you can actually see um, the um, how, how that looks, how the macro mode works. 
uh, when using still photography. In still photography mode it's, it's more than usable, you don't have to get half as close. And you get some lovely shots with a macro uh, lens attachment and like I say the macro lens attachment the only difference is is, um, is the other lens screws on top so once again that's the, the little lens there that just screws over the top screw it over the top and then swap the arrow clip back round and you get a really nice uh, kind of mid range, it's much wider than it was before kind of view in fact to compare the view when you switch your phone from picture mode to video mode you notice that it zooms in a little bit um, this pretty much undoes that, uh, that zoom in so if you want to sample what it, what your video would look like um, with an OLO clip, then certainly on the iPhone 5, all you need to do is um, is just put the put it into camera mode and walk around, not video camera mode. Put it into camera mode, walk around, and that what you're seeing through the uh, on the screen there would be the equivalent that would be the video. Uh, obviously when you, like I say, when you move it over to video mode it completely uh, goes out and finally just one more, that's normal before was wide and this is the 170 degree kind of ultra wide setting so that's a very short kind of demonstration of the OLO clip 3-in-1 lens system and the case doubles up as a lens cleaner, you'll be pleased to hear. Fully coated optics, as you can see. It's really nice. Available from the Apple Store. Uh, you can uh, pick this up from Apple Store in Manchester. You can buy it online as well. And I think it was about 70 quid. Something like that. 70 or 80 quid. So it isn't cheap. Um, but there you go. There's more uh, more details at paulhurstphotography.com, including a full write-up and some samples for you to enjoy. So, see you again. Bye.